judo coach called it the Kingston roll. I think it's after a, named after a British judoka that popularized it in probably like the late 90s. Uh, one way that I would uh, go for this is if, if someone tries to do, let's say, an ippon senage. For the ippon here, I manage to time it. I bring him down. So what I have now is not a super deep grip here, but I'm weighing down like this and I've brought him down to all fours. So what I'll do from here is step this leg over, get the grip behind the thigh and roll over into a pretty perfect bow and arrow. All right. The other way you can apply this is having turtle and not much to lose. And then you, then you go for this. Um, sometimes you'll find a partner, maybe a former judoka, that's like the most common thing in, in judo is being too chill in turtle. Let's say you have someone, they're just closing up in turtle, you, they're not moving too much, and you know that if you lift up here to put this leg over, there's a decent chance they won't roll or stand up or do something. That's the other uh, situation that I would do this from. So, or if I just want to like show off on a blue belt maybe. So from here, Basically just step up, get this leg over. That's the main thing that we have to do. And then I'm reaching behind the thigh or even the pants. If, if he's like super close here, maybe even like a brief inside the pants move could work here. I roll over and I adjust my grip to the inside of the thigh. I preferred uh, that grip for the situation here. And then it's just a classic bow and arrow. So depending on how advanced you are, you can do both. So if you do the Ipon Senage for me once again, so I'm using circular movement here to get out of the way. Rolling into this roll, like so. And then from the ground, from turtle, being safe, not putting my arm in here, shallow grip. And I'm gonna get a deceitfully shallow grip with this main choking arm. If I do this here, most people's alarm bells are going crazy, like choke inbound. Down here, like, they, they don't really know yet. So as long as I'm keeping this nice and tight, I put a hand on the hip, get in here. If I don't have anything to grip, I'll just grab whatever I can and then switch it to here. Finish the bow and arrow. All right, this is like a, just a cool move to try before we get into sparring. Any questions? No, just one comment. Yeah. This is actually known as the Jodanowski rolling. Okay. <laughs> All right. Check it. Check it. Check it. Check it. Check it. Can you record it? <laughs> so this is Joe's choke. Sorry, Mr. King. Yeah. Sorry, Mr. Kingston. Uh, your choke has been renamed. Link to Joe's video in the description below. Let's go. One, two, three.